Hey guys, I'm Belness and welcome to another episode of Short Ghosts. Today I have Nicole here. Hi. <laughs> and we are bad. <laughs> oh my god, I don't think I've really been like full on bare face before. In front of the camera. Yeah. Yeah, I think same. I do you feel comfortable? Uh not super not so far to be honest. Same. I feel very I feel a bit exposed. Yeah. I yeah. think like everyone feels more secure, even if it's just like a little bit of makeup on. Yeah, right. Then, like a yeah. bit like tinted uh sunscreen or something. Yeah. And because the light you, yeah, you can't yeah, really the light all right. Floss, please <laughs> don't put on to HD. <laughs> okay, I it's think we, we should keep it rolling so that we can faster put on makeup. Okay, so how long do you usually take to do like your casting makeup? Uh, I feel like my casting makeup and my normal day-to-day -day makeup is the same. So maybe about mm. five minutes. Five? Wow! Yeah. Okay. Fast game. Fast game. Yeah. If you go for like Europe placements, right? Mm -hmm. Do you feel like there's a difference between like Europe casting and like Asian casting makeup? Uh, for Asia castings, it's definitely a bit more like I think I cover up more. Mm. Yeah, because like I don't want them to see my flaws because I think it's not that open yet to yeah. like imperfections in Singapore. But whereas in Europe, uh, casting directors actually love it if they can see like your bare skin. So like maybe let's just say like freckles or mm. even on this casting I went for, they asked us to take off our makeup so they could see like how your actual skin looks like. So there are girls there with like acne. Oh wow. And like full face like freckles, yeah. So and we just asked them to remove. Like they just had makeup remover there. They, they, they just pass you the makeup remover, yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, so but and also because in Europe their casting makeup is super minimal. Yeah. I think if you put on like a just one base of concealer or foundation, yeah, it's like good to go already. Don't need eyeliner or anything. Yeah. No no eyeliner. Yeah. Super different than in Singapore. So I feel like my casting makeup, right, has been through three major transitional phases. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so the first one, right, we have under and then after that try too hard, yeah, over. over. That's and the then worst, yeah, I think. That's the worst. and then now it's normal. I mean, I hope it's normal lah. It's normal to me. So after we get settled into basic, obviously you need your first like snaps to show clients and all that, right? And she made this comment. She was like, Yeah, this is the first time I've seen you with makeup on. I can't believe I signed you. <laughs> not that She's I'm so yeah. savage, huh? Not that I'm ti chola, right? But it's just that yeah. I have very good memory. <laughs> so I can't it years later. Yeah. <laughs> so I keep like, because every time, I, I was I was 18 when I first got in contact with basic, oh, so yeah. I was still in school. And my first few meetings with her, I would come in after school in my school uniform and bare face. I thought I was giving her a clean look, you know? Oh, I, no. I wanted to be that clean. That was a very bad mistake. <laughs> <laughs> and you joined basic when you were still in school also, right? Oh yes, I joined basic when I was... I think 18, turning 19. And it's okay because... I shouldn't have laughed, like, because same. I came <laughs> in so with, loud. <laughs> with really bad brows and... It was so thick, like two caterpillars on my eyes and my face were like round back then because they have like baby fat. Oh somehow. yeah. When I saw the picture that Bond posted the other time of my casting steps, oh my gosh, it was so bad. I saw! And wait, someone actually commented, they're like, oh by the way, Nicole, you look like an alien but very high class alien. Thank you so much for trying to make that comment better. Yes, thank you very much. High class alien, alien okay? <laughs> it's, it's okay. You grown up. <laughs> yeah, but that was a very interesting comment. Mm. I do not still remember, yeah. yeah not that you see told, yeah. I just got a good memory. Yeah, you know? memory yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we are actually here to do like a 10 minutes casting makeup challenge. Okay. Do you think you can do it? I think I can. I think it will be easy for me, but actually, yeah, you'll see, yeah, because my normal makeup is 5 minutes. Yeah. So, but if you talk, maybe I'll get distracted, you know. Then I'll take like 20 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck to you. Yeah. What? <laughs> and I put on my headband, <laughs> can maybe? Okay, I'm gonna use this Bobbi Brown, like, it's like a skin serum with foundation. Because, you know, I like my makeup to be... You know what, I was gonna say that I like my makeup to be bare minimum, but I don't think I can say that beside you. So, I don't know about that. Yeah, I feel like mine is really bare. Yours is really bare. I feel really weird doing my makeup because every time I have to do my skincare and I do my makeup straight away. Mm. So now that I did my skincare and I went out of the house and my face has touched all the germs, I feel really weird and uncomfortable. <laughs> Don't think about that. Oh my god, that's so interesting. It looks like a mask. 
It does, right? But it's a clean. So I actually put it on like uh, parts of my faces where there's like red dots. Oh, so anyways, I use my hand to blend out afterwards because I'm quite wretched and I don't owe any She really be minimal, right? Yeah, I just like, <laughs> do your... <laughs> okay, so I use this like foundation, right? It's an intensive skin serum foundation and I love it because I prefer a foundation that gives me like a light slash glowy kind of like coverage. Can you see? I think you can see. Like, you can still see some imperfections showing through. But I, I like that. I like What's that. This? It's a Bobbi Brown foundation. Oh. Yeah. It's like the skincare in foundation. Wow. I'm actually not really good at makeup. Huh? <laughs> yeah, so like every time makeup artists tell me like what products they use and like let's just say there's a serum inside or whatever, whatever, I'm just like, oh, interesting. And then I'll go Google it, but and I'm not buying it because it's actually quite expensive. But actually, you use quite. Like you use the same product for long periods of time. Yeah. Then and I try not to do makeup every day, so my, my makeup can actually last me for a really long time. I don't know when was the last time they gave me this. <laughs> not too long ago, I haven't expired yet, yeah? Then do you, do you, like if you use foundation, right? I actually don't use foundation by self, myself. Like I only oh. just recently received a foundation. Oh, like, yeah. okay. So I thought you on tried my not normal, to use... No, on okay. my normal basis, I don't use at all. Oh my god, okay, we're running out of time. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I'll go for this, nude sticks. This, this one, the coverage is pretty good. So I have like, okay, like the last one, right? Maybe I'll use it for like my pimple. Are you panicking? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I don't have that much of a blessing, okay? I still need to do some work on my face. Okay, okay, blend, 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 blend. I use like, I try to use like a lighter colour for my under eyes so that it brightens at the same time. Do I look too white? <laughs> I'm done with my base. This is how it looks. Okay, so when I go to Europe, right, this is actually just how I do my skincare. So I just put Dr. Judd and I'm done. And I curl my lashes, I'm done. But do you put sunscreen? Yes, I do. I actually okay, went on... Great. Uh, went for placement recently with Amy and Quinn. And when I told them, I said, oh, I need to apply it sometimes. They look <gasps> at me, they're like, Amy was like, Nicole. <laughs> And Nessa ambassador yeah, the coming Anessa through. Ambassador was like, you should use Anessa, it's really good. It's really good. Eh? I use Anessa as well. I use it every single day. Okay, every Anessa, single day. I'm gonna come for you then. I'm gonna buy you. Okay, now I'm gonna mattify my face. Okay, this one, okay, I gotta pet it one time. Good one, let you see. Okay, <laughs> I'm done. Okay, can you see? Oh, that's cute. Wait, what? Why is 10 minutes so fast? Oh my god, we have like four minutes left. Wait, I just spent four minutes applying this. <laughs> this is a really distracted. Okay, so right, I want to ask you something. Yeah. Like a while back, you posted on your IG, right, that you used to have very bad brows, and just now you said, right, very boxy brows. <laughs> so how do you achieve that look? Oh my god, okay, so that was when uh, everyone was hyping up. That was when I was in like 17 or 18, and that was when everyone was using the Benefit brow. Like it was the trending. Brow pencil, yeah, is the it? brow pencil. So it was trending and everyone was using it. And I just decided to buy it. Because I was like, okay, oh my god, my brows are... I mean, my brows is something that I'm really proud of because it's not thin and I, it like, has a nice... Okay, not, now not so nice, but because I haven't shredded for a long time. But uh, yeah, so I just wanted to like shape it up. But I didn't know that it, I shaped it up until that thick. Oh, so you just use I the just pencil? I just use the brow pencil to draw it out. Do you draw like strand by strand or you colour block? No, I, I do this literally, the thing, I draw, I draw, then down, and then I blend. Can we insert a picture, can we? <laughs> yes, you can. When, when I saw it that time, I was like, why did nobody tell me that my brows are so bad? Fake friends, huh? They probably thought that you're oh, winging the trend. the trend. Yeah. <laughs> I actually wonder what's, if there's any difference between like a... a Fashion model, casting makeup, and a commercial model, or is it just the same? Uh, well, actually, I think the later. I think fashion models makeup right is definitely much more minimal. But I've been to commercial castings and I see the people, I see people there with like full face makeup, like they do their hair, they have like lashes on, the brows are like filled in, like basically a like a going out makeup look, you know. So you know like you say you track your brows right? I used to track my brows as well but because they hurt right, I stopped. 
and um, bushy brows became a thing. Yes, I'm so happy. I love bushy brows. Yeah, right. But then now there's a TikTok trend where everyone does thin brows. What? Like because it's like retro or ni 90s. Like, yeah. Oh shit. Okay. But anyways, I've been also really wanting to bleach my brows. So please guys, um, yeah, I asked Bon so many times and she always said no. So can you help me by like leaving a comment down below? But Bon, bon will allow me to bleach my brows. Let Nicole yeah. bleach Please her brows. Please let Bon know. She's rolling her eyes now behind the camera. <laughs> also now because Jasper bleached his hair, mm. and then he, I think he kind of like lightened his brows a little bit. It looks so good. He bleached his brows before, right? Yeah, he regretted because he said it grows like really funky. Oh, it finds like, the quality. Bleach your brows in Singapore is kind of. Kinda. Okay, we oh have 17 God. seconds left. Literally, I'm not gonna put eyeliner. I'm not gonna put mascara. I'm gonna go in with my. I'm gonna go in with my lip oil. This is my new holy grail because my lips keep cracking with the. Because I have to put lipstick every day now for shoot, right? I need a good moisturizer. <laughs> okay, I'm done. This is so incomplete. I feel very stressed. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I think 10 minutes is a bit... I think maybe if we don't talk, 10 minutes is like just right. Yeah, yeah. If you're speeding. But I guess the foundation time is like your time for your doctor jet, right? Mm. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sad. No, I'm not done for makeup actually. I, was, I, I didn't want to curl it like... like okay, curl, 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 curl. Curl it now, curl. Okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> So the, if there's something that I must do, right, is to always leave my house with cold lashes at least. Oh, that's but, your thing. Yeah, I try. Unless I go to like the market or something, uh, then swa. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna get free fish from the uncle. Uncle, uncle, ni hao ma. Today there's some more yu. So this is your not very comfortable kind of rush makeup look. Yeah, I see. I think it's okay. But you do it. You do your brows. Uh, I put a bit of gel. Put a bit of gel. Nice. Thanks. Very clean. Hey, you don't put blush. Uh? Oh no. Casting what? I used to I try to put blush for commercial casting. Oh no. Because I feel like everybody looks so like full face, right? That if I don't put some colour, I look very bland. Oh true, so, yeah. true, true, true. <laughs> so thank you, Nicole, for taking the time and for you know sitting through this slightly uncomfortable yes. thing for you. If you have any comments to share, if you have any shit to say about makeup. Can't can lie, okay? Ha, huh, please don't. <laughs> <laughs> if you enjoyed this episode, please do give it a like, um, hit subscribe, and click the notification bell. I can't speak. Notification bell button. Yes. <laughs> My name is Valnis, and I'll see you in the next one.